in this video I'm going to make this Lockheed Martin Skunk Work sign. Thanks for watching. Enjoy the video and consider subscribing. So to kick off, I am applying a coat of some ceiling paint as undercoat. Don't ask me why, but I find when I undercoat the enamel, it goes off twice as quick. So unfortunately I lost a bit of footage but I gave the piece two coats of oil based enamel with 48 hours dry time in between the coats and I applied a layer of sticker vinyl on top of that which I slightly baked on outside in the sun. Then I routed it out with my mostly printed CNC. If you would like to see the full car video, it will be on my MPCNC playlist. cut through halfway with the NPCNC. The rest I did with the jigsaw and the flush trim tool on my router. So now I'm starting on the fuzzies in the bottom of the calves. Normally I prefer to start off by burning as much as I can out with a soldering iron, but my cheap iron is broken so I'm using some sandpaper.
With a quick pass of 220 grit sandpaper, I'm now applying a coat of some PVA wood glue. I do this because I like the way it sands and it kind of seals the MDF. So now that the PVA has dried, I am hitting the calves with another pass of 240 grit sandpaper.
with the carvings all sanded and fuzzies, I am now applying two coats of gloss black enamel with 48 hours dry time in between the coats. I've also painted this outer ring with the enamel white so the red has the same colours as the writing I will do later.
with the final coats on the calves dry, I am now masking up to airbrush the outside ring. I only had this red for my airbrush, so this is what I'm using. But I'm pretty happy with how it came out. Now that I have the paint painting done, I am removing the masking.
So unfortunately I've caused a bit of damage to the base paint. I think I left the vinyl out in the sun a bit long. I also left behind a fair bit of glue residue. Off camera, I've touched up the paint and removed any glue residues. So now I'm masking the paint, masking to paint the outside ring black, which I was almost going to skip because I ran out of oil based enamel black, but I decided I want to do it, so I'm going to paint it with rattle can. With the outside ring painted black, I'm now cutting out the stencils for the Lockheed Martin Skunk Works with the vinyl cutter on my mostly printed CNC. Here I am applying the stencils and remasking for some paint.
unfortunately I didn't get a clean peel off some of the letters but the reference image I am working off shows some damage so I don't mind it worked out well actually alright thanks for watching I'll see you next time